Bonjour, comment ça va? Hope everyone is doing well. Um, Aujourd'hui, je vais faire un vidéo uh, sur des choses dans une cuisine typiquement. Today, I'm going to be going over some vocabulary. We're going to practice some typical items that you find in your average kitchen. So let's get started. So um, this is Kahoot. So I'm so excited. Uh, let's start. You can play along, keep track of your own score at home. Okay, there's 25 questions. Cusco say, I'm so excited. Okay, so the red one is bear. Um, the blue one is onion. Uh, the yellow one is oof. The green one is jen. And it's gonna be the blue one. Because, so, oh, oh, I have to do here. Okay, right, so the red one is butter. Uh, the yellow one is egg, and then the green one is jen, which means people, and of course onion, is onion, onion. So let's let's press next. Okay. Alrighty, next question. Qu'est-ce Here we have okay piscine, par asset, and miru. Okay, so the red one is a uh, pool. The blue one is uh, fear, the yellow one is plate, and the green one is mirror. So I'm gonna choose the yellow one because that's the correct one. And I did this test so I know the answer. So I'm just gonna pretend like I'm seeing it for the very first time. <laughs> okay, uh, next we have a microwave. So how do you say microwave? Okay, well, the red one, Arjun, that means money. The blue one, mia, that means better. The yellow one, menu, that means menu. And the green one, microondes, translates to microwave. So I'm gonna press that one with only seconds to spare. There she goes. Oh, she's on an answer streak. Okay, so far I'm winning. <laughs> Cusca say, okay. Let's see what we got. Fork, okay, how do we say fork? Okay, so the red one is fair, that means to do. The blue one is utile, that means useful. The yellow one is vivacit, that means liveliness. And then the green one is forchette. And it's the green one. So fork is forchette. Okay, let's go next. I just got a lot of points, guys. We are on a roll. We are in question five. Okay, spoon. Okay, that makes sense, right? So the red one is couleur, the blue one is attentif, fun one to say. The yellow one is pantalon, the green one is souris. So the red one is spoon, the blue one attentif is attentive, the yellow one is pantalon, which translates to trousers or pants, and the green one is souris, that means to smile. So I'm gonna choose, oh my god, couleur. Ooh. That was a close one. Almost didn't make it. Okay, question six. We're moving right along, and let's see what we got. Okay, so this is stove top. The green one. I mean, the red one is also, which means bird. So pretty. The blue one is cartouche, with which means cartridge. Okay. The yellow one is cuisinier. Okay, I'm not gonna tell you that one just yet. And then the green one is mochette, which means speckled. Okay, so I'm gonna go with the yellow one because it's, it's the yellow one. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Doing so good. We are now on question seven. I'm excited. Let's see. Okay, so this is oven. The red one is fort. Um, the blue one is four. Uh, the yellow one is soup con. And then the green one is palaçon de entrée. So fort means strong, right? Strong. Um, the yellow one, subcon, means suspicion. Ooh, scandalous. And then the green one, palaçon de entrée, that means entrance mat. So I'm gonna go with the blue one because that's the right answer. Whoa, so close. Okay, we are now moving on to question number eight doing so good okay so refrigerator this one's pretty self-explanatory but let's go through them anyways the green one refrigerator just refrigerator with a french accent that's how i remember it anyways uh but anyways the red one very i can't struggle with this one race and mable 
Oh, okay. That means uh, likely. Okay. The blue one, pelote, that means ball. The yellow one, rapine, means fast. And I gotta be fast to get the right answer. <laughs> okay. We're on question nine. Oh my god. All right. Okay. This is a dishwasher. The red one is lave vaselle. The blue one, dentrifice. Uh, the yellow one, le reisme. Realisme. There you go. I said it right. Okay. And then the green one is promise. Okay. So dentrifice is toothpaste. Uh, le realisme is realism. And then the green one, promise, is promise. So lave vaselle is dishwasher. Oh yeah, good job. Okay, woohoo, we are now on question 10, in case you're wondering. We're doing so good, guys, keep it up. Okay, this is a table. I mean table, oh, it's a, see? It sounds, just just say it with a French accent, okay? Um, blonde means blonde hair, I mean blonde, okay? As you know, you have blonde hair, not me, but. River A, uh, river, okay, that's the yellow one. Green one, Marty, is Tuesday, okay? The blue one, table, is table, so. Oh, oh my God. This is like, you think you have so much time, but 30 seconds goes by like that. Like super duper fast. Okay, question 11. Okay, it's a pantry, food pantry, right? You know, to house your food. Okay, so papillon, so beauty. It means butterfly, I love butterflies, okay. Uh, the blue one, bra, that means arms okay uh the yellow one nuit that means night okay and then the green one garde ma manger means uh uh what is this called again Ooh, pantry there you go oh yeah if you look at the garde manger uh garde it kind of sounds like guard like you have to like watch it and make sure that no one steals your food and then manger means to eat right so it's like you could look at that and be like, oh yeah, you have to eat what you guard, you know? That's just what I use to help me memorize these vocab words. Okay, here we have a pan. Okay, so first one red, la pot, mm, that means pasta, okay. The blue one, pole, that means pan, okay. The yellow one, costume, that means suit. And then the green one, oh my god, Simulatone. Oh my, it means simultaneous. I can't say that one. That one's too hard. See, simultan. I don't know. I'm gonna have to listen to that one, you know, because I have to hear it a million times, and then maybe, just maybe, it'll make sense. Okay, we have a pot. Okay, uh, the red one is casserole. The blue one is pluser, uh, the yellow one is entrion, and then the green one is voyager. Okay, so casserole means pot. The blue one, pluser, that means several or many. Uh, the yellow one, entrion, that means interview. And then the green one, voyager, means to travel. You know, have you ever heard uh, when people are leaving to go on vacation, they're like, bon voyage? <gasps> no! Oh my god, I'm talking too much. <laughs> no! <laughs> I lost the point. <laughs> okay. That happens sometimes, right? It was casserole, in case you guys were wondering. And that means, and that makes sense, right? Like when you're, it's kind of like a food, right? Like, oh, making a casserole, you know? So, we are on question 14. We're so close. Okay. Uh, the red one is rasson. The blue one is Chauzer. The yellow one is Fatigue. And then the green one is Serviette. Okay, so Rasson means reason. The blue one, uh, Chauzer, that means shoes. The yellow one, Fatigue, that means tired, fatigued. Just fancier English, right? And then Serviette, that is the correct answer. Moving right along. We just have some more questions left. Okay. Oh, I love to say this one. The red one, soissant. Woo, sounds so great. Okay. The blue one, billet de entrée. Okay. The yellow one, ivia de cuisine. The green one, visage. Okay, so soissant is 60. 
a billet de entrée, those are entrance tickets, and then Visage's face, and then Ivia de Cuisine is kitchen sink, which is the right answer, and I'm gonna press that one. Mm -hmm. And that was right, okay. How are you guys doing, by the way? Hope you guys are getting a lot of them right. Okay, Cauchemar is the red one, that means nightmare. Mm, I know. Okay, the blue one, bon you. that means suburbs. Nice. Uh, the yellow one, ball. I'm not gonna tell you. And then the red one is content, which means happy. And so, judging by the fact that I didn't tell you, you know that it's actually the yellow one. Ball, okay? Very similar, just missing a W. <laughs> but that's how you, that's how you spell it in French. Okay, okay, and um, there's no picture. I'm gonna add a picture here. Uh, altrice is altruist. Okay, the blue one, passoire, that means strainer, like a kitchen strainer. Uh, the yellow one, jupe, means skirt. And then the green one, introverti, uh, that means introverted. And then you add that E when uh, it's feminine, okay? When you're referring to a, a female. So it's gonna be the blue one. Cool. Alrighty. Uh, there's 25 questions because I wanted to make sure. I just couldn't pick, you know, so hard. Okay. Uh, Sucre, Centaur, Airport, and Singes. Okay. So, the blue one, Centaur, that means belt. Okay. Like a, like a cinching almost of the waist. Okay. Uh, yellow, Airport, that means airport. <laughs> and then uh, Singes means monkeys. And then Sucre means sugar. So, I'm going to press that one. On to the next one, on to the next one. Hey, hey. We're in question 19. Okay, uh, the red one is Saman. Uh, the, the blue one is Ri. The yellow one is Sol. And then the green one is Sel. So which one is it, hmm? Okay, so the red one, Saman, means weak. Uh, the blue one, Ri, means rice. And then the yellow one, soul, means only. And then the green one, cell, is salt. So I'm going to choose the green one. <laughs> what do you know I'm in first place? <laughs> All right. We're in question 20. We're almost there. Okay. The red one, papier, that means paper. The yellow one, celibataire, that means single. And then the green one, fait le corps, that means to do their shopping, okay? And then the blue one, planche à découpe, that means cutting board. So I'm gonna choose that one, the blue one. Very fitting for today's shirt. We're on question 21. All right, okay. The red one is port. The blue one is orlage. The yellow one is couteau, that's yellow, the yellow one. And then the green one is jammy. So the first one, porte, that means door. Think of it like a portal, like an entryway, okay? The blue one is horloge, which is so fun to say, horloge. That means clock, okay? The yellow one is couteau, that means knife. And then jamé, the green one, is never. So I'm gonna choose the yellow one with only two seconds left. Yes, lightning smart. Thanks. Oh my god, question 22 already? Okay, we're doing so good, guys. Okay, the red one, poverty, means poverty. Uh, the yellow one, etre on it, that means be honest. Just be honest. Okay, the green one, increase de identity, that means an, an identity crisis. <laughs> okay, we've all been there. Okay, the blue one, grill pan, that means Toaster, so I gotta choose that one, okay? I'm gonna answer streak. Yeah, that's me. Okay, the red one, jambes, that means legs, your legs. <laughs> okay, the blue one, déjeuner, that means lunch. The green one, shod, that means a oh, hat. And then, uh, like, like temperature-wise, and then mixer, uh, that means your, um, your blender, which is the correct answer. I want to choose that. Okay, oh my god, we are on question 24. We're so close, guys. I'm so proud of you if you guys are still hanging in there. You're awesome. Okay, the blue one, glass, that means ice. The yellow one, rue, that means street. 
and the green one plage that means beach and then the red one there means glass which is glass okay we are officially on the last question i know you guys can do it do it with me okay the red one histoire histoire that means history fancy okay the blue one sacado that means backpack if you look at sack it's like a like a sack you know it's like a bag okay the yellow one detendre means to loosen or um uh, to relax you know and then uh the green one boudoir d'été that means kitty kettle okay that was right <laughs> all right let's see <gasps> what 23 out of 25 oh i'm still first place hey she in first place she in first place comment down below what you, how many questions you guys got right and if you got any wrong comment down below your um, mistakes and how you fix them because it doesn't matter how many you got wrong it just matters if you know why you got it wrong and make sure you go to your google translate to hear the auditory format um, I'm definitely going to be doing a more in-depth version on some of because a lot of the items there they were clothing items they were food items so I'm definitely going to be doing some more cahoots on those just to make sure that we don't just see um, the writing representation of it I want to teach you these vocab words in all three formats so there's auditory visual and then writing um, all of these in conjunction are more likely like one of them's gonna stick with you right because at the end of the day the main goal is to practice enough where you have it memorized inside of your brain forever so you know that's that's the plan so I'm really excited I'm looking forward to doing those cahoots because those are gonna be super fun and hopefully I can get really um, really creative enough for you guys where you enjoy them as well and it's you know fun for you to participate so um if you watch this video thank you so much if you stay till the end keep stay tuned for the next video because i'm definitely going to be doing more of these in the future all right guys stay safe au revoir